Hey guys, welcome back to Little Lady Plays. Today we're going to review this game. It's called Brain Freeze, and let me tell you, it is a lot of fun. So if you want to see how to play this game and all the other games I'm going to review, don't forget to check out the channel. So before you start, you're going to need to choose a piece. So over here, my tile is letter E, number 8. It's going to be a bubblegum milkshake. So how do you play? The opponent... Oh, and also this, it goes up on a stand and it blocks your opponents, but I'm going to show you this quickly. So the opponents are going to have to guess things. Let's, And they're going to say, let's say, um, it's going to be 5C ice cream sandwich. Ooh. So I'm going to say simply only answer yes or no. So if I'm the opponent, if it's no, I know it's not here. No, it's not here. No, it's not lime. So I'm gonna, I like this over here, this little, I call this a visual guide. So now I could rule out lime and I could rule out ice cream sandwich. Then uh, um, the opponent is gonna say, let's say, is it this? Is it seven? So no, it's not row seven. I know that. Is it F? No, it's not F. Is it banana? Nope. And is it a snow cone? So I'm just, again, one word, no. So the opponent can use logic skills. Remember, the opponent's job is to guess, kind of get into your head. It's not so easy if you think about it, but again, we could rule out banana, and we could rule out a snow cone. So again, getting into the head, so what's the next one going to be? Let's say it's going to be, hmm, where should we go? Oh, let's say the opponent's going to choose this one, and I'm going to say yes. So I have one yes, not too many clues to go off of. I know it's not banana, and I know... Well, it could be H, so maybe, you know, based on this, let's go with H, let's do this one. So I'm going to actually, we know it's not G, we know it's 8, could be chocolate, I don't know. So I'm going to try something chocolate to test my theory if it's chocolate, so I'm going to go with this one. So we know it's not E, we know it's not 9, we know it's not chocolate, and we know it's not... Um, an ice cream cone. So I'm just going to say no. So no, the opponent's going to cross this off like this. Now I would say, because we said no, the opponent can rule out chocolate. So now we cross off chocolate. We don't know what these two have in common yet. I'm gonna cross off chocolate. I'm going to cross off ice cream. But then I look, oh wait, these two are in eight. So I'm going to keep the eight open. And then just happens to be by default, I'm going to guess this one. E, eight, uh, bubble gum, and it is a milkshake. So happens to be this one worked out. I got it right. And yeah, I won. But usually not so fast. Just worked out the way the board worked this time. But anyway, so the key is for kids to use strategy clues. Now, I'm doing it right now. I've practiced this game. I've played it. But I have one learner who still does not... Not, not understand it. I mean, just let's think about this. We have, I'm going to show you, look at what the child has to focus on. Per turn, mind you, it's per turn. They have to focus on a letter. They have to find the number. Oops, eight got erased. They have to focus on the letter, the number. They have to figure out the flavor, and they have to figure out the milkshake all in a grid. So what does the kid have to learn? The kid has to know how to use a grid system. The kid has to have the logic skills of process of elimination. And the kid has to have the visual feedback skills to actually work the board. I mean, hello. To me, that sounds like math problem solving. I love it. Look at this. Brain freeze equals math problem solving through games. Now, some tips. The first thing, let's go back to the board. <laughs> you saw how I crossed it off. Very important. Let the kids circle and cross off. Another thing, if this was my board, let's say I'm going to go for the milkshake right now. If this is my board, I'm going to circle it and put a little sun around it. So I can visually see my piece over the opponent's piece. Next thing, if you have kids, like, like I mentioned before, I do have one who's struggling a little bit. And I love it. I hate to say it, I love when the kids struggle. But when the kids struggle, that's when I know they're learning. So in order to help them... What I might do first is pick one thing we're going to focus on. Forget the letter, forget the number, because that's a grid system. Let's just say I want them to figure out a milkshake. 
just going to go for a milkshake. So we'll erase the board quite simply because I also believe do it slow. We'll erase the board. We're going for a milkshake. Let's say, is it a snow cone? No. Is it an ice cream? No. Eventually, they'll get to milkshake by crossing off all of the ones here until they figure out a milkshake. So keep it with one. Let them work the board. As they get familiar, add two things. We're going to go for the uh, banana snow cone. Again, now it's two things. Then we'll get to column, then we'll get to row, or in this case, letter number. And again, you just want the kids to build up on skills. Not so much give them the game, have so much fun with Brain Freeze because it is a great game. They'll have fun. But when you have a kid that's struggling, build it up slow. So do I like this game? Yeah, I don't like it. I love this game. I love games that make kids think that are out of the box. Yeah, I can give them 100 math worksheets and say, hey guys, let's have math worksheets today. And there are some fun ones out there and huge thumbs up to all you creators of the fun worksheets. But this is a different way of bringing fun to the classroom. And best part about it, it's a two-player game. So you can actually bond with a child as you're talking. Great conversations, I guarantee. If you guys like this game, don't forget to subscribe to our channel because we have so many more things to share. Thank you so much for visiting us and don't forget to check out the description box below and pick up your very own brain freeze. Happy playing!